amputees learning to move with a prosthetic is a new challenge. It can feel like an unmanageable limb that does not feel normal. Thanks to a new mind-controlled prosthetics, this can change. The new prosthetic limb helps amputees walk and move more naturally. This video from the United States Research University, MIT, shows a patient walking up and down the stairs with a near natural gait. This is possible because of a surgical procedure that allows the brain to connect with the prosthesis to mimic natural movement. The surgery called the agonist antagonist myoneural interface or AMI allows the body's nervous system to control the prosthesis like it would control a natural leg. The prosthetic limb relays information from the patient's muscles to their nervous system helping achieve more natural movement. When the limb is amputated, we connect muscles in natural agonist antagonist pairs. Um, so that when the person thinks and moves their phantom leg, those muscles move dynamically just as they did before the uh, leg was amputated. We then put sensors on those muscles to detect activations and movements. And those data are then uh, decoded by small little computers on the robot that tell, tell the machine how, how to move. MIT researchers with colleagues from Ringman and Women's Hospital studied seven people who had the AMI surgery and seven who had traditional below-knee amputations. They found that AMI patients could walk faster, avoid obstacles and climb stairs more naturally than others. They also experienced less pain and less muscle atrophy after surgery. The procedure is still in trial stages, but researchers believe it will open new possibilities for amputees when it becomes commercially available in about five years. For all the latest news, download the Weon app and subscribe to our YouTube channel.